Welcome back to Eat Day. Today we've got a special episode for you, one about family, or... Ohana? Ohana. Yes, today we're gonna to be teaching you guys how to make a staple in the low country, which is chicken bog. Yeah, baby. Now we do this chicken bog every single year. We are related, as most of you know, and we go down to Edisto Island every year. This is a family tradition for us. It's been, it's been happening for a long time. A long time. So it has four key ingredients. Chicken, sausage, buttered rice, and vegetables. And vegetables! And while I'm here, let me talk to you about your car's extended warranty. So we are actually using chicken breast tenderloins for this. Now, most people would use meat with some kind of bone in, maybe even like chicken thigh. We use chicken thigh in the past, but we've got a lot of people in the family that are not crazy about chicken thighs. So we're using chicken breast tenderloin, and I'm just taking off a little bit of that, uh, some of the ligaments, some of the sinew, so that it's not as chewy. But chicken thigh does add more flavor. All right, so we've already got broth in here. We don't show that on the video, but we've already got some broth. I'm gonna add chicken. Now, we're gonna let this simmer for a little while. I'm actually gonna add a Fidelia onion as well and a clove of garlic. Oh yeah. All right, so this is Guadana. This is a soda from Brazil. Okay, uh, in our family, this is kind of one of those drinks that we always have around. Uh, has nothing to do with chicken bog, but this is everything to do with chicken bog, right? So uh, get you some, Amazon, yo. Okay, so I just wanna start by apologizing uh, about Jacob's knife skills. Uh, that is not at all how you handle a knife in the kitchen. So actually we're gonna do, we're gonna show you how to use a knife. So with garlic specifically, uh, you can really go with like a more like a stabby stab. Uh, if you do this long enough, uh, it'll definitely mush itself up. Uh, so yeah, just you know, keep going to that for a little while and you'll have it figured out. Ooh, that garlic. I like garlic. Y'all like garlic? Is that all you're putting in there? Just no, I'm doing more in the max. Right. I'm gonna use the whole clove, but yeah. Dude, that is like already all the way cooked through. Do you see how tender that is? Yeah. Let's get that out of there. It's done right. All right, we're taking some of the chicken back out of the broth. This chicken, now that it's done, it's gonna go back into the, the chicken bog or the rice here in a little bit. We're gonna start the sausage now. All right, next we're gonna take the sausage here. And we're gonna add it in. It's going to the same exact broth that the chicken just came out of. That's important to note. And you're gonna leave it in there until it's cooked uh, or 160 degrees if you have a meat thermometer on hand. We don't, so we're gonna watch it change colors and then make it. Right. We're gonna cut some onions. A little life hack here. You didn't know this type of protein. Oh, that's spicy. We're gonna make so many people angry. <laughs> oh <my gosh. laughs> Did that skin? So All right, we're gonna go ahead and shred the chicken and get it ready for the bog. All right, so we 
just transferred the broth out of our big pot and into here. And then what we're gonna do is get our onions started sizzling in here. We're gonna do a little sauteing on those, get them all nice and mmm. And then we will start adding the rice and getting things going here. All right, now we're gonna add some of the garlic and the sweet Vidalia onion. We're gonna let these saute. Some people say Vidalia. Yeah, it's Vidalia. Mm -hmm. That's gonna get us demonetized. All right, guys, so we got a pot full of onions going right now. We're gonna do the no cry challenge. Should be pretty easy for me because all my tears already left this morning after my three hour go with it. So, all right, let's, let's get started. The point of this is to hold your face over a sauteing pot of onions for a solid 30 seconds. Just Chris is up. Nothing. I'm doing it. Here I go. Good job. All right, guys, so we're, uh, we're now gonna wash the rice. Whenever you wash rice, you wanna make sure you get the starch off the outside. If you don't, it gets a little uh, mushy. So right here, we actually have a special grain. It's called the invisible grain. Uh, it's actually, you know, it gets pretty popular right now on Instagram. It's uh, kind of a health conscious rice. So if you're like, you know, trying not to eat carbs or anything like that. How many calories? Uh, this one actually right here is about zero. It's about the healthiest rice option you can get. Uh, so, you know, just give it a shot. Gluten-free? Yeah, uh, gluten-free, dairy-free, soy-free, peanut-free. Um, Fun free, I mean, it's all those things. Rice free? Yeah. Um, actually, no, it's not. It is what you say it is. Um, so it is rice. Thank you very much. Sorry. All right, so the onions are finishing up. In just a moment, we're gonna start our rice and then we will gradually add in our chicken and then finally our sausage so we don't dry it out and overcook it. So uh, at some point, all of this is going in the pot. All right, time to start cooking the rice. All right, guys, we're scooping ours in there because we just washed this. We don't want like any extra water to come in there, so we're trying to like make sure we. I see it. See it. Zoom in right there. Okay, see how there's some extra water. We don't want that water to get in our pot because we have too much water to rice ratio, which would then make our rice a little squishy. Uh, we don't necessarily want that. Stir to combine. Are you looking it up online? Never. All right, we're gonna go ahead and add part of our mixture. This is the chicken and the onions. And now the rice is not entirely cooked yet. So the final thing is gonna be the rice steaming and cooking to perfection. We're gonna go ahead and stir it in so that it's kind of mixed in throughout. We're gonna let the rice kind of cook around it. We're gonna stir this for a couple of minutes and then we're gonna add the sausage. Different people use different vegetables in this. Some people use- Did you say vegetables? Actually guys, while I'm here, I'd actually like to talk to you about your extended car warranty. Uh, some people use stuff like celery and okra. We choose not to, but we will add some chives in here at the end, even though uh, that's not something we've typically done in the past. Stir it in a little bit, and we wait for the magic. 
Well, you'll see. Alright, so we're actually doing this last part here. It's pretty simple. We're just letting it all cook together. Um, it's really important, uh, like when you do a rice, that you get the heat up high. You need to get it hot first right now. You can see we don't have any simmer or anything. Once we get this up, it's like a little slow boil, um, then we'll go ahead and cap it off. We'll turn it on low and let the rice, you know, take time to soak in and get all fluffy. Cool. Spicy. It's boiling. All right, now that it's boiling, we're gonna put the cap on it. We're gonna. Did you say it. boiling? You know that could actually do some major damage to your car. So maybe we could have a minute just to talk about your car's extended warranty. And we're gonna boil it. It's boiling now. Just ruined everything. All right, we're gonna do a little check-in. Oh, look at it, coming alive. <laughs> there it is, guys. So, all right, so we, we made our chicken bog, and guys, it looks pretty good. Um, rice should be, you know, nice and kind of sticky and firm. Most excited. It's all in there. I mean, man, it looks really good, but you know what looks better? Uh, probably a new, car, like extended car warranty. Um, so if you're interested, just hit me up and I can maybe help you out with that. Um, but anyways, back to the show. So who wants to try it? Anybody wanna give I'll it a try. try? Give me a bowl. Oh, okay. Let's hook it up. Oh, so all right, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, a sticky traditional chicken bar. We've got chicken, rice, blood up, sausage. Don't get any better than that. Remember on this channel, did you say vegetables? Today, today. <laughs> hey, you did not let me finish. <laughs> bro, I didn't know what you were saying, bro. I didn't let me finish. Oh, the good one. Oh, that's perfect. That's it.